classification of vectors and scalars. Let's first define an important word, magnitude. Magnitude is the size or length of a measurable quantity. Now, a scalar is a physical quantity that has magnitude, but no direction. Let me give you a couple of quick examples. Age. Age is a scalar. You can only say that you're 12 years old. You can't have a direction to that age. You can only tell the actual amount of your age. Uh, and then another example would be temperature. There's no direction to temperature. Uh, another example would be time. One hour, there's no direction to hour. You can't say one hour west. You can only give you the actual amount. Distance. And lastly, charge. Here are a couple of quick examples of scalars. Next up, vectors. A vector is a physical quantity that has both magnitude and direction. To give you an example of this, velocity. So for velocity, I can say that I'm driving 50 miles per hour west. So I've given both the magnitude and I've also given a direction. In addition, an other, scale, other vectors include acceleration, displacement, and finally force. These are all relatively new terms to you, but by the end of subject two, you should be familiar with the majority of these terms.